there. I've ordered some things to do optical modifications on my base, so let's get started after the intro. So here we have turning knobs and a pick guard that I'm gonna cut up. I started playing bass in late 2017 when I was asked to just try it out and I liked it so I kept playing. My first instrument was a Squire Jazz Bass, this black one, but it was borrowed so when I moved to a new city two years later I had to buy one myself, which is this one. And after I had it for about a year I decided to change things up a little and made a pick guard out of a vinyl record, which was by the way a Christmas album, but I designed a label and put it on top. I still liked the look of it so I will definitely keep it and maybe use it next year or something but now I want to try a different style so let's go yeah those feel nice I never particularly liked the knobs on the chest base much better than the plastic things I think I already have all the tools I need in there. Oh, by the way, there's the old pick guard I used before the vinyl one, just black. No idea what I should use to get these off. No way I'm getting these off just by hand. Oh, now it's okay. The first one wasn't that hard, but I think the second one, okay, with a little help, comes right off. Okay, now the new ones. Feels much more nice. I was kind of worried the two blacks wouldn't fit together, but it turned out just fine. Okay, so now for part two. One thing I'd like to keep though is the general shape of the pick guard. As you can probably see when you have these side by side, the original one has this part over here, which I cut off the rhino one because I wanted the pick guard to be a little smaller and also it would have obstructed the view of this sticker. <laughs> so we have to do that with the new one too because I want to retain the shape. I just hope cutting the plastic works fine. So I cut off this part and then also try to cut off a horizontal line here. So it's kind of like a telecaster pick guard. So let's see. I can make this work. Ah, turns out it's kind of hard. Result. What do you think? As you may have noticed, it's the next day. It took me a lot longer to finish than expected, but that's because the pickguard's fitment was horrible. I had to do a lot of sanding to make it align properly and I also drilled a new hole in the body. It doesn't look perfect, but it's good enough, I think. Now, if you also want to change up the look of your bass or guitar, here's some further inspiration. If you want to see me play this bass, click up here. And with that, I'm out. Thanks for watching and see you next video.